Hi. Hey. How are you? Oh, a little fried, but um, much better now that I see you here. Please, mm. come in. This was on your doorstep. So, what's got you so fried? Oh, a number of things. I spent most of the morning looking through all these reports that arrived from Fusion. That was fun. Oh, I, I have no desire at all to go to some last-minute function for the hospital, do you? No, zero. Not at all. I'm a little fried myself. I got problems with Emma. It's not... No, 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 it's not Annie. She hasn't <clears throat> gone after custody again. Well, that's good. Yeah, but she won't stop. I'm sure it's gonna come sooner or later. I just hope that she waits until after the holidays. Mm. Well, then, what, what is it? Well, I have absolutely no idea what to get Emma for Christmas. I don't. And considering you have little experience with shopping, I thought maybe you could help. Apparently, she's into these, mm. these dolls that you can plug into the computer, which I know nothing about, and I need some advice. Erica? Hey. What's really wrong? Enjoy the holiday! <laughs> well, the whole staff is gone and won't be back until after New Year's. Mm -hmm. So we're all alone. Oh, yes, poor me. I'm, uh, I'm stuck here alone with my beautiful <laughs> new bride. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, oh! somebody must have dropped something on the way out. Look. Uh, uh. Huh. <laughs> it's, uh... What is it? I think it's an invitation. Yes. It's a um, holiday benefit for the hospital. Mm-hmm. This afternoon. What? Well, that's a little last minute. Well, yeah, maybe they think we should uh, be in jail by now. <laughs> or uh, it possibly could be the wrong house. This is addressed to the biggest hearts in Pine Valley. Hey. What's this all about? Oh, you too, huh? I have no idea. Hmm. What, the chief of staff doesn't know about a holiday hospital benefit? Well, whoever sent it, they didn't get permission from the hospital. Hmm. You gonna go? I think I should, just to see if it's legit. Jesse's working late on the Madison North case, but uh, I'm leaving on a few. This is so strange. Oh, you want company? Is that what you're saying? Oh, that would be nice. Thanks. Yeah? Yeah. Well, I'm curious to see who's doing this. Okay, well, this is obviously the right place. Where is everyone? I have no idea. I guess we're early. Well, who's hosting it, Angie? I can assume. Well, look, why don't you have a seat? I'll go get us a drink. Martini? Yeah, dirty. Two dirty martinis, please. Sure. This is not a good time, Gail. What's up? Just the update you wanted about the new meds. The patient's responding somewhat. You're kidding. All right, look, I'll get back to you later on, okay? But don't call me back. Not today. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm great. Some people think I'm dying. Like I said, Mr. Devane checked out last night. And you sure he was alone? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was behind the desk when he left. Uh, he said he had to leave early. There wasn't a woman with him? Mm, just that one time when that cane woman showed up. Uh, the one on TV. What time did he check out? Mm, late. About 10 o'clock. Just to let you know, we are in an abandoned warehouse in the middle of nowhere, so if you want to scream, the only thing you're going to do is annoy me and I'll just retie that gag. Understand? Aiden, Aiden, please, please. 
You're alive. 